Re-recording videos fucking blows. Hello, I am the Zombie J, and this is a another part analysis video. This time we're going to take a look at a Baraki foot design. This time, well, this is the only Baraki foot that I took a look at because most of them were, of the Baraki were just, you know, well, whatever. At least half of the Baraki were just using, well, reusing parts that already existed in the repertoire of, you know, Lego's catalog of parts. <laughs> and of course, we're going to be talking about the Pridak foot. This piece is very awesome. It, it looks pretty cool. It's very excessive, especially when you go towards the back, but it tapers in such a way that it's almost very elegant in its design. Look at this thing. Look at this thing. You can't tell me that this is not an elegant and very well-crafted, uh, well-designed piece. It's got a uh, plus rod right there, axle, and a couple of different areas where you can put pins into. So, in theory, you could obviously use this as a head design, because this was how, you know, the Zyglac combination model was done. You could use it, you know, sandwich a couple of them together, and build some stuff off it, which is what Karzani uh, was used, uh, how that was done, which was a creative way of using the, this foot design. Just sandwich it together, slap on some parts, and put it as a head for a mutated version of a character who's basically the uh, Satan of Bionicle. Um, yeah, it was used three different times. Two official sets and a combination model. How underutilized do you think this piece really is? Well, based on the the amount of uh, sets that it was used for, and the combination model as well, well, unfortunately, only three fucking times. And that is bullshit, honestly. I mean, it's not as underutilized as this piece. Come on, Lego. It seems like a, a thing with Lego. They came, they come up with a piece like this, they underutilize it, and they forget all about it. Because, I don't know, fuck this piece? No, this piece is pretty fucking useful. It can be used as a head like this for like a Rahi, or like a, a head like this way. Or it could be used as a weapon. Just put a, a hand, uh, uh, socket in through that axle and this is usable as a weapon yeah just trying to crucify yourself with it yeah <laughs> um, hell even like this it could be used as a weapon you know so, um, it could be used as a foot yes it could be used as a foot like this way a little bit excessive because yeah but it could also be used as like decoration for a vehicle of some sort either on the side on the bottom or on the top in whatever configuration you want have it as an angled piece like this you know for something have it as uh, a torso <coughs> as a torso armor just put a glatorian neck right there and away you go put on a nika style uh, building torso skybird did a uh, mock that used this foot uh, for that and kind of a nice use of that uh torso th or, or of this uh of this piece and you know there's this little thing in the center there it looks like the illuminati eye of some sort <laughs> it's like what the hell um you know i like that I, li I like the the shaping and just overall design of this piece. There was definitely some love that went into this piece of polypropylene, and it works, and it's a useful piece, and you should try using it. If you can't find a use for it, you're not trying hard enough. If you think this piece is totally unusable and is complete, wor completely worthless, fuck you. Because, you know... It's definitely a piece worth experimenting with, worth playing around with, and trying different sort of uh, design uh, philosophies, you know. Just come up with something. And if you are not willing to, you're an idiot. Because 
you gotta, you know, expand your horizons. Use a piece like this and tr just try. Actually, don't try, do. Because this is a piece that is deserving of more attention than I feel like it has. And it has only been used three goddamn times for Prydac, for Karzani, and for a combination model, which doesn't even fucking count. I mean, come on, really? This is a piece that should have been used for other things. It could be used for Rahi, it could be used for bipedal, you know, uh, bad guys. It could be used for uh, a Toa. It could be used for a Glatorian, like I said, for the front torso thing. It could be used for, like, the Patera. I know the Patera, there was a, a mock that was done pretty damn well, and it looks like it has the Alec Claws for the things that used to kill Toa with, which, okay. Um, but this could be used as, like, an alternate weapon if in, in case you didn't want to use those claws. Use this. Incorporate it into the uh, arms or hands of the uh, Patera, and utilize it probably better than those claws um it just has a really nice design and really nice you know uh th th there's definitely some possibilities with this one you could also use it as back armor like this or like this you know i implore you to try it to try using it yourself if you have it in your collection there's only two colors of it available in white and uh, Metro Red. I almost said Metro Blue. That would be a nice recolor. You know, this only had two fucking colors for it, and that is fucking insane. What the fuck, Lego? I mean, seriously. I, I'm i pretty sure some bootleg uh, copies of this can, can be made in many different colors that were uh, obviously produced back in G1's run. Like, Metro Blue, like I said, that would be nice. Or Metro Red. Or, obviously, Black. Uh, Metro Brown would be nice, too. All the Metro colors. <laughs> um, we already got Metro Green, so... Uh, Mata colors as well, like Mata Red, Mata Blue, Mata Green. Uh, that, the original Mata Brown color. Um, you know, Yellow would be nice, too. Um... <sighs> What else? Uh, hell, even obscure colors for Bionicle sets like pink. You could probably make a pink character with <laughs> with a pink one of these if you really are so inclined. Um, you know, I don't think anybody's going to do that, but hey, <laughs> it is what it is. But yeah, this is a piece that has uh, some utility to it, and it should be utilized because... You know, it just proves that it can be done. It can be done, and it should be done. So, do that. Otherwise, this is just another piece that Lego sort of tossed away and forgot about. Because they're jerks. It's really sad, because this is a piece that I have just a lot of respect for in its shaping its design and just it, it looks f phenomenal at least from up top and from the sides like this and whatnot it just looks great it looks grand it looks like something that you that doesn't even look bionicle in some way but it is bionicle and that's what makes it great this is a bionicle piece and you know it try it out for yourself don't you're missing out I'm serious you're missing out on potentially using one of the greatest uh, feet foot designs of all time for either a torso for a torso armor for either back torso armor for whatever you fancy it's just possible so do that with that being said, stay tuned for more videos. I'm the Zombie J. I'll see you folks later. Have a good fucking day and peace.